Hello there and welcome to episode number 8 of my FIFA 21 Road to Glory series with Barrow. Today is Judgment Day as we try and push for the playoffs. By the end of this game, we will either have our destiny in our own hands or potentially be out of the running completely for a player spot, especially with the games in hand that teams have on us. This season has been pretty crazy, especially when you look at some of our earlier results. Losing 5-1 in the first game of the season, sorry 6-1 in the first game of the season wasn't really ideal. But the team has steadily improved and the addition of a new front line, as well as finding a tactic that worked, seems to have pushed us higher and higher up the table. Hope you've enjoyed the season so far. If you have, then please like the video and subscribe to the channel and continue following this journey. So this unlikely push towards the playoffs has all come from just an absolutely unbelievable run of form really over the last kind of month and a half I think. Um, the last game was that Leighton Orient game uh, which we won 3-2 on the last video. We then won 4-1, 8-0 against Oldham at home which was just obscene. We just, every single thing we hit went in the back of the net. And then a 6-3 win away from home against uh, Tramit. So today's game against Bolton, uh, if we can get a win here and a win against uh, Stevenage, I think that is, in the next round, in the next game, then uh, I think we're pretty much guaranteed a playoff spot. And here we are, here's the table. We're currently sat in sixth. I say we've got uh, the Cheltenham, so the Bradford team, Bradford City are uh, below us but have a game in hand. Forest Green have got two games in hand on us, so we're not going to probably catch up with them. Cheltenham are probably the ones we really need to keep an eye on. Um, we've lost both games against them as well in this season so it is in our own hands at the moment but um, we know what can happen I mean look, just look at those goals for I mean, 121 goals for is just obscene 111 goals against is just awful so yep let's see how we go uh, win both games and we are in the playoffs so let's get straight on with today's game then for some strange reason I'm actually a little bit nervous I wasn't expecting to be like this but um, I suppose I really, really want to try and this is my first time at Legendary so it would be an awesome awesome result to get into those playoff spots. But we play against Bolton today away from home who currently sat 10th in the league so um, let's see how we get on against them. Well, it really wasn't long ago that Bolton were in the uh, in the Premier League. Um, massive fall from grace, really, for them. Uh, Owen Doyle, pretty handy striker. They play this, the same formation as us, so be interesting to see how we kind of go up against each other. Wing backs are obviously going to be massively important in this game, as they always are for us. In terms of our team, um, pretty much as as we have been playing, uh, we've got a, a good strong starting eleven now. Uh, certainly in the summer, it's going to be building on that and, and trying to. Um, Trying to get a bit of strength and depth as well because we soon lose quality once the further we go down. Nice quick start needed here, I think. Let's see if we can get a couple of goals in the head and then um, hopefully ease my nerves a little bit. So trying to get rid of this free kick to Bolton straight away is good, good headed clearance and we've got a chance to now to, to break against them. Um, Achari is the one on the ball. He's going to lay a nice little ball through to Jones. It's a foot race now. To see if he got a bit of strength as well. He's got the strength to get away. He can have that shot, and he's stuck it in the bottom corner. Fantastic start for us. Six minutes gone, and we are one nil up already. What a player Jones is. Well, here it is again. It's all about the pace in transition. They were so quick to get out from the back, and when he gets through to the keeper, he just smashes it. Well, that is an absolute dream start. Exactly what we were looking for. The the way we play now, I say we've got, we've got that pace up front from Jones. The Chari is pretty handy at holding it up, and we just keep hold of the ball and frustrate the other team. And it's it's really starting to work now. I must admit. Trying to block off, but they've got him behind us now, and they've got to try and stop him from putting a decent ball in. Said they go, they go low ball. Chance to get rid of that boss. Oh, he's missed that header. I'm surprised he missed that. But get another chance to get rid of it. And this time we do manage to get rid of it. But playing, oh, it's an awful pass. And he's turned and he's going to shoot and he's stuck it in the bottom corner. Absolute 
made, a, made our own worst enemies there. Awful, awful decision making by me, and a bad pass, and it's one. Of them. You see it again, Derek. He's just unaware there's people around him, and he loses it too easily. Then it's catch up, and they can't recover. Well, straight away I started thinking, oh, this is going to be easy. You know, it's, it's another one of those games where we're taking a good early lead, but our defensive frailties come into place again. And it was just well, it was bad decision making by me on that one, I must admit. And the emphasis is on creativity. Delaney. Bolton have come into this one now, I think. Oh, it's a nice little laid off ball there. And got, got to try and stop them getting in behind us, but it's a lovely ball in. Dixon manages to come out and claim, claim it. Pretty comfortably there, I think. It gives us a chance to build again. We, we're not normally working on counter-attacks, but they've got players forwards now, so we've got Unlith managed to get into the back. You could lay a ball in nicely there to Jones. Jones has got straight in there, buries it in that bottom corner. He just outpaced the centre-half. Huge gap in behind them, and we managed to lay a nice little through ball through. And it's his second of the game. It's a really lovely through ball, and sometimes with all the time in the world, you can fluff your lines. But he composed to consolidate this lead. Cool heads. Well, as they kick off, Jones is he's, he's far too good for League Two, and he's probably too good for League One as well. He should be playing Championship, but we've got him, we got him for 500k, and uh, I think he's going to be probably the star of this series. Lovely ball in behind for Barry. Barry run on to, he can stick a ball in. Oh, he manages to get a, they managed to get a good tackle in, but we've recycled the ball again. Jones. Little one-touch passing. Oh, Jones on the first time. What a strike and what a finish. What a player that man is. Hat-trick, 3-1. Really nicely worked. Team goal there. Fantastic play and um, build on this now. I think I'm not going to not going to make the same mistake again. Let's build on this and just try and score some more goals. Playing out from the back again. We we'll quickly turn this uh, defence into attack, but in, not in a complete counter attack. A bit more of a measured way. But lovely ball in through there. Gribbons. He's through now. He's he's scored a few goals as well and a little chip over the keeper, taking the mick out of them a bit now. 27 minutes gone, 4 1. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. And you can see what he's thinking as he allows the keeper to get close to him. And then the little dink is fantastic. Goals and plentiful support. Well, this is, this is just like a match of the day highlights package. Uh, I'm struggling to keep up with this. We are. Again, we're in that position where everything we hit is going in goal, but they're good goals, I must admit. It's playing some nice football and scoring some uh, really good good goals. Delaney. This time, Bolton Delaney managed Crawford. to get their foot on the ball. Nice little play through the uh, centre and midfield positions there. They managed to get through. Laid a nice ball in there and they got it through on goal, but I think he was offside. I'm going to be very annoyed. No, yeah, he was offside. I, I thought he looked... I'm sure I saw the uh, Lionel's flag come up there at the bottom of the screen. Oh, thank God for that, because that was... It was a nice play, I must admit, but we got a bit lucky there. Working our way, getting out wide to Barry again. Barry's played really well out there. He's causing them all sorts of problems. And again, he's in behind their, their wing back. And, oh, my word, Jones has just run straight past their defender. And buries that one. Great ball in. Fantastic finish. Fourth goal of the game for him. 5 1. You know that. It's a beauty. And from there, the soft cushion volley is an absolute dream. I love this goal. Total satisfaction. Blistering first half. Well, apart from that one silly mistake to concede their goal, they haven't really created anything. And it's been pretty much the perfect performance. But. Oh, watch out, Jones. Let's not get you sent off as well. No. Yellow card for Jones. And, uh, yeah, it's been pretty much perfect. So, two minutes added time coming up now. We've got two, two out of four minutes, sorry, so far. Um, just keeping hold of the ball. If we can create something, then fantastic. But just get through to that half-time whistle 
There we go, Jones has, Jones has got in behind again. He could lay it off to Achari's through. Surely not another one now. 6-1, yes it is. Pummeled into that top left-hand corner. What a finish there from Achari. And he's proven he's not just the side note player him. He is the real deal as well. I would say I feel a bit sorry for Bolton at the moment, but this was us at the beginning of the season. We were the ones getting pummeled all the time. But that's it. Ref blows for half time, 6 1. What a start. So now it's just about keeping up the pressure. Just probably try and play out this game now. If we get some more goals, awesome. But um, yeah, don't want to be conceding anymore. That's, that's death for definite. Barry again, causing all sorts of problems. Lovely ball through, and Achari's got another chance here. We're going to try for a little bit of a worldy one, and he's pulled that one wide. We are all over them. We played so well today. Lovely little ball through to Jones. Jones has another go, and he's hit the crossbar. Fantastic strike, just a little bit too high. Doyle now for Bolton, lays it into Miller. Miller's got the other side of Zuma, and he's a good save there from the keeper. A couple of quick subs then, just to just to kind of change things up a bit. But oh, it's a oh, what a, another really bad goal to give away there. He was just stood in the middle of the goal, all on his own, no defender around him, and they buried that one. Ball into the box from the corner, and it's a sweet strike. Absolutely lovely, controlled, stylish finish. That's a real shame, that, because that was two, two disappointing goals we've given away. We, we don't want to be giving those kind of goals away if we get into those playoff spots. I'll give you that one. Jones. Here. It's a goal for Been a quiet 10 minutes, but chance here again. We'll see if we can put a nice ball in, and this time they've managed to clear it. Oh, and now trying to work their magic, see if they can get themselves back into this game. With 20 minutes to go, I sincerely hope they won't, but it's a decent save from the keeper. So, from the resulting corner then, see if we can get rid of this one, get it good clearance, and we've, well, we've managed to clear it eventually, but he's a little bit kind of frantic there, I must admit. And we've just got to try and keep hold of the ball now, nice play. Well, we've had a couple of chances, but nothing real, real threats. Maybe that one that hit the crossbar, but this time James has managed to get himself through. See if he can hit a good shot, and it's straight at the keeper. Really disappointed finish. But we've had some decent game management, I must admit. We uh, into that last couple of minutes now. I've added time. I say we haven't really kind of pressurised them too much with other more goals, but we didn't need to. You know, six to the score at the moment. They were never going to get back into this game. We absolutely outclassed him in that first half. And with one more minute left of uh, added time, just try not to concede another one. Would be nice. No, nah, there you go. They're going, oh, they're going it back to us, but they've got the ball straight back. Nice little ball in there, and the referee's done us a favour and blown for full time. 6 2 winners. I uh, must admit, I picked that one up thinking it was going to be a really close game there against the team in 10th place, but we absolutely hammered them. And more importantly, that's now us four points ahead of Cheltenham Town, who are the only ones who could catch us in that um, in those playoff spots. So we are in the playoffs now. What an absolute crazy result after the start we had to this season. Um, there's still teams around us with plenty of games in hand, so we've probably finished in that kind of sixth, seventh spot. Um, but I'll take that, I must admit. Um, we're in the playoffs, and that means the, the next load of videos will be probably a playoff semi-final doubleheader. Something to get nervous about again. Nothing really to see now in the schedule, because we don't know who we're playing yet, but as, uh, as soon as I know, I'll stick it out on my social media so you uh, everybody can know who we're going to be playing against and who, uh, who the next video is going to be up against. Well, it's not very often you get fairly simple, straightforward wins like that on the FIFA, so I'll, be, I'll, I'll take that every day of the week. Um, really looking forward to these playoffs. I'm going to get this other game played. 
and then um, I'll start getting myself ready for that for that playoff semi-final double header. Um, thank you very much for watching this video. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed it, um, and I hope you will stick around to watch the uh, the next couple of episodes as well as hopefully we try and get ourselves up into those League One League One spots. Um, as I said before at the beginning of the video, please subscribe to the channel. It really helps me out and uh, it really, really gives me that kind of real lift that um, sometimes you need during these strange times. Uh, and like the video as well um, is always appreciated. Hope you have a great week, weekend, and I'll see you all in the next one.